Welcome to Gull Lake in Michigan, United States. More than 30 beautifully restored star boats with their crews were there to enjoy another edition of the renowned Vintage Gold Cup, which has been established with the motto, honoring the past, leading the future. If you're given the opportunity or you have the opportunity to come sail here, it's an absolute must. It's a bucket list item and uh, just highly recommended. And it's not even the sailing, it's the wooden boats, it's the, the beauty contest that comes along with the wooden boats, but it's the camaraderie of hanging out with your really good friends and meeting many new friends from really all over the world. I got a crazy idea. What about restoring more wooden boats and creating an event around that? Well, it took some convincing, but as time went on, uh, I could see his vision. He painted it very clearly for all of us to see. We've been able to attract some of the best star sailors in the world, and we've got a great representation of uh, this year. Seven countries, seven gold stars, Olympic champions, Olympic medalists. Yeah. I'm thrilled to have everybody here, and we're excited for the, the seventh running of the Vintage Gold Cup. Really, really going to have a great weekend. Yeah, it's, it's very competitive. I raced against Lars in the World Championships many times and, you know, a lot of these other sailors, Ross McDonald's been sailing in the class for many years, so we've all raced against each other in the Olympic Games and in World Championships and still we find ourselves here in these 60-year-old wooden boats and we just raced two races with Lars and he won, he was first and we were second and, you know, it's the same old battles that we've been having for many years. It's cool to revisit that era, I think, of our sport. After the conclusion of the competitive part of the event, the winners of the 2023 Vintage Gold Cup were Brazilians Lars Grail and Mauricio Bueno, leaving Josh Powell and Luke Lawrence in second and Joe Londrigan and John Wasocki in third. used to sail tornadoes, but uh, since uh, 2000 I started sailing stars and became in love with that. It's very unique, very unique because we are in a wonderful lake, sailing those wooden stars, all really well kept and competitive among themselves. And it was a very good idea because the star class, we have a, a great history, né? it's a centennial class. So you have the high-tech boats, the World Championship, Continental Championship, the Bacardi Cup, but you have the Vintage Gold Cup. And here it's so special because you find seven former uh, world champions. Once again, the Vintage Gold Cup brought together sailors in a true celebration of the star class.